Well, hey guys, welcome to another video. This one's gonna be a day in the life working edition. So I'm gonna take you along with me with my whole day of work so you can get a sneak peek into what I do and what my day typically looks like on a weekday because I do only work Monday through Friday for the most part. With YouTube and my online job, I do work sometimes on the weekends depending on how busy my week goes, but I'm hopping right in and working on that oral hygiene. So I've been using this Gobi toothbrush. They sent me it to test out and I really like it because it does have like the setting where it vibrates to let you know when to move from quadrant to quadrant so you get the best brush clean. So I like it, they have a bunch of different colors. I've been using that. I also tongue scrape my mouth every day. I just feel like it helps with any kind of bad breath and there's actually a bunch of benefits that go with it. Maybe I'll make a video on it in the future. I washed my face with the Yes to Tomatoes Charcoal Gel Cleanser. This is my favorite, I've been using it for years. And I'm working on an Amazon storefront, like influencer store, so I'm gonna put my favorite products in it and that will be launched soon. So I'll let you guys know when that's up because I'm really excited. It's gonna have a bunch of my favorite products in it. And I like to try to make the bed every day if I can, just because I do work from home a lot of the time and having that clean bed made, like clean slate, just helps keep a calm, organized atmosphere. I just feel like it mentally helps with anxiety and stress if you just have at least a made bed every day. So even if it's messy like this and not perfect, I try to make a point to make the bed every day. And then I turn my plant light on, which is over all of my plants on the shelves that you see when I film my regular videos. That keeps them alive because there's not a lot of light that hits that wall. And then I make sure I drink some water. That's very important, especially first thing in the morning before you eat any food. You want to try to get your body started with just some water. I'll hop onto my computer next and as you can see I'm uploading a video for you here. A lot of the time I will make sure before I even head out the door in the day I will check my emails and respond to brands that want to work with me. Right now I'm on the phone with my cousin because she's actually going to be working with me today gardening and you know I'm hiring her on my team. We're working together and I'm just giving her directions on how to get to the house, one of the houses that I work for. For. I'm just switching into some work clothes for gardening. I just wear something comfortable, easy to move around in, something I'm not going to sweat my butt off in when it's really hot out. Just a simple tank top. That one's by Violent Gentleman. And my favorite deodorant by Zion Health. You've seen this video before. If not, I will leave it linked down below. I love this deodorant. I'm almost out of it. I'm gonna have to get another one, unfortunately. My favorite toner is by The Ordinary. I'll have that linked down below as well as any other products that I have before I get that storefront up for you guys to shop on. But I like to tone my face in the morning and night. It's very important. Helps with hyperpigmentation, evening my skin tone out. And I always put a moisturizer with sunblock on before I go out gardening for the day because I want to protect my skin, especially for anti-aging, 27 years old. That has to be kept in mind for that. And I like to protect my lips with some Carmex, just the original. I feel like this is a really good protective lip balm just in the elements with wind and everything. I hate when my lips feel dry. I always make sure I bring a water bottle. This one is one of those water bottles that keep it really cold throughout the day, no matter if it's like sitting in the full sun, which is super important for me. I really like refreshing cold water when I'm working. So I bring that. Sometimes I bring an extra water bottle just in case with me. I bring a snack with me because I don't like to eat too much in the morning right before I leave. I leave really, really early so I don't have a lot of time to make food. I usually do that later. Then I'm gonna throw on some socks and some shoes. They're just crappy shoes, whatever. Then when I head out the door, I need to grab some garbage like lawn and leaf bags with me to put the weeds in when I'm weeding. I have this whole setup with a bucket and like a tool belt that goes around the bucket. 
throw that into my car, and then I'm headed out for the morning. My work varies from day to day. It depends on the size of the property and the conditions. But for some houses, I go once a week and some I go a few times a week and I usually stay an hour or a couple hours depending on the task at hand. Today at this one client's house, I am just pulling weeds out of the dry stream and that's pretty much what I did for the duration of this time. I kind of went around the bed that was near it and pulled weeds out, but for the most part, this dry stream really needed to be weeded and it's pretty large, so that's what I focused on for the day. I do also work from home for my other job listing medical supplies online and I absolutely love that one as well and I'm so lucky to have it so I'm on the way home to do that. It's time to shower. I'm disgusting. When I get back from gardening I usually do a dawn bath. I just use the hose, dawn dish soap and a washcloth because I'm very susceptible to poison ivy but today I don't think I was in too close proximity to most of it so I'm just jumping in the shower just take a regular shower and I make sure I exfoliate and wash really well just because I'm filthy I'm gonna change into regular clothes so I can start working and before I do anything else I like to make sure my face is moisturized since I probably just washed it again depending on how dirty I got so I'm just putting some flora and bast oil on my face I'll leave that link down below and my favorite lotion at the moment is Twilight Woods by Bath and Body Works I make sure I put that on my skin because it gets dry as well, especially if I'm doing a Dawn soap shower in the hose outside. <laughs> and for breakfast, I will be eating some egg whites. This is my favorite thing to have when I get back from working outside for a few hours. I just feel like there's some protein involved in it and it's not too bad for you. Um, frying up the egg whites I'm gonna add some avocado and some tomatoes into it I flip it in half and then I add some cheddar cheese as well or whatever cheese I have but usually cheddar that's my favorite one to add and then I take a gluten-free wrap and I put it all inside of the wrap fry that up with it sometimes I don't fry it but then I just wrap it up in together and it just is the perfect breakfast for me. And that's usually, usually had at like noon. So I guess it's like a brunch slash lunch for me. I'm drinking the lemon ginger Kavita kefir water, by the way, I love that. And if you haven't seen my video about kefir water versus kombucha, you should definitely check it out. I'll leave that in the description. After I eat, I like to make sure I have all my plants watered. I do have a good amount of plants outside in the garden, in beds, in the ground, all over my house. So I need to take care of them and make sure they are watered as well. And I like to trim and harvest whatever I can when I see it. So I have a lot of mint, sweet mint, spearmint, and chocolate mint all growing in the garden. And I'm just cutting some of that, which I will end up soaking inside later. And then I hang to dry it because I can't consume all of this mint fresh in like a day or so. So I dry it out and put it in a mason jar, crush it up, and then I have it all winter long to make teas out of. And right here I have a 
big zucchini that's ready to be picked so i'm gonna pluck that off i've been getting huge zucchinis out of this one plant all summer it's been awesome and actually this year is the first year i've had pumpkins i have little ones and i had a big one grow as well so i just pulled one of these little guys off i think the colors are so pretty on this After taking care of everything outside, I make my way inside and sit down at my computer, which is where I spend the duration of my workday. I put on some Flora and Bass Relief Potions. This is a CBD oil that's really good for sore muscles. I use this almost every day when I sit down at the computer because I do get sore shoulders and my lower back gets sore as well. I love this brand. I love their products. So I always keep it next to my computer so that I can easily access it. And yeah, this is where I spend the rest of my day, working on my computer. Sometimes I put some lo-fi study beats on and I have my tea with me as well. So that was pretty much what a typical work day in the summer looks like for me. Every day is different. I end up doing more of one thing, less of the other. Maybe I'm interrupted by more housework or cleaning that I have to do and other errands, but just to give you a little taste of what it's like for me on the daily. I think it's obvious to say that every day is different because no matter what job you do, every day has something different. <laughs> but I hope you guys really like this type of video. It's a lot of work to film, but it's really fun to edit. And I love giving you guys kind of like a look into my own life and kind of doing these stripped down videos kind of mixed in with the fashion related videos and reviews and all that. So if you want to see more videos like this, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel for more videos, press that notification bell down below as well. So you get reminded every time I post a new video, that way you don't miss one because I'm always posting random things and you might want to see it. I don't know. I'm going to go make dinner now. I'm probably going to have some soup and Dan's going to be home soon and we're going to hang out. He'll probably be doing homework so I'll probably end up working more on my computer later and then I'll go to sleep. So yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Who knows what topic it's going to be next to be honest.